I mentioned I don't want to complicate this process and I mean it. Like I think shed training should be as simple as possible. And so for me to process that, for me to make sense to me, I've tried to break it down into really three easy steps that have a bunch of layers under them. The first step is shape conditioning. I really need to condition the dog to understand that the shape of an antler is going to equal a retrieve, which is positive. That's their reward. The second step, scent. What's this thing smell like? Scent discrimination. So there's a distinct scent associated with the antler. It's the same as the visual, except this is them using their nose. And the last thing that's physical for the dog is the feel of that antler in its mouth. You know, dogs, especially these retrievers, have been bred for hundreds of years to have soft mouths. And when we start introducing hard horns to that, it can cause some problems that we've really got to be conscious of. So the feel of the antler is last. Three easy steps, shape conditioning, scent discrimination, and finally the feel.